Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to our channel. As you can tell, today we're doing a Ulta haul. If you guys like the video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel for more hauls and more makeup videos. Check out our beauty brand Moonlight Rose Cosmetics. That is all for the intro. Let's get started. The first thing we have is the CeraVe Renewing Essay Cleansers. The one of the own cleansers that I use. This one and the First Day Beauty ones are my two favorites. I got the 8 ounce. I thought I got the 16 ounce, but I didn't. And it's leaking. <laughs> don't know why but when I opened the box it was leaking and it's still leaking so we're gonna put that on the floor for now next up we have two of the ordinary hyaluronic acid serums again I think I said this in the last Ulta haul I feel like this product has been in every Ulta haul that I've done because I'm always running low <laughs> so I picked up a new one and a backup because I am completely out this is what it looks like I'm sure you guys have seen this all over TikTok and Instagram yeah again it's cheap and effective so picked up two Next up, I picked up two of the Kiss Lash Glue. Again, this is the only lash glue that I use, so I picked up two. I think this was supposed to last six months. Yeah, six months. I've had mine a little longer than six months, so picked up a new one and a backup. <laughs> Next up, we have two more repeat items. The first one is the TJN Honey Honey Miracle Hair Mask with raw honey and olive oil. It looks like this. It's the, my favorite hair mask what it looks like at least my hair very soft which is surprising because I have extremely dry hair so I love this this and a deep conditioner makes my hair super soft so can't wait to wash my hair <laughs> next up something else I also always feature will usually feature in my Ulta hauls is the vanilla co cleansing balm I got a big one this time it looks like this right now I have the travel size which is literally this big <laughs> Here's the full size. It comes with a little like cap and a scooper. Which to be fair, I like, always lose mine or I don't know, it just doesn't stay in there right. But my favorite cleansing balm. I use this every day to remove my makeup and or my sunscreen. So highly recommend. It's kind of expensive, it's $26, but it does last you a long time. So next up we have the Kind Ship Mint. Oh, it's mint. I never know that it was mint. Mint mud mask is a deep pore detox mask. I think I saw a deep pore detox mask. Like, okay. I didn't even read that it was mint, so it's a mint mask. It also says this jar is made from recycled plastic, so we love that. I never use anything by Kind Ship. I think my friend Aaron likes their sunscreen. I think. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Definitely smells like mint. It smells good though. It smells like a piece of gum, so. That's what it looks like. Next up, I have another mask. This is the 4th Ray Beauty Avocado Superfood Nourishing Mask. Looks like this. Another green mask. Which well, this I've already smells. Smells just like avocado. But not edible like the last one. Yep, it kind of smells like... Actually, no. It's kind of smells like avocado, but it mostly smells like their, their face milks. If you guys ever tried those. Next up, another food-related skincare body care item this is the tony molly watermelon do all over sugar polish like this look, looks like an actual watermelon the container is actually nicer than i thought it was going to be so it's a body scrub you guys never tried any products from tony molly i don't think their body care but their makeup is pretty good and i can't get that <laughs> but yeah i don't think ulta sells their makeup but if you want to try their makeup you can Get it on guest style, that's where I personally get it. Oh, it's very sticky. <laughs> it smells like a Jolly Rancher. Yeah, that's very thick, as you can see. <laughs> that's what it looks like. I'm excited to use it. Hopefully, I'm not sticky after. <laughs> Next up, art is out the box, but this is another product by Tony Moly. It is a peach lip balm. It's so tiny and cute. They also have a peach hand cream which looks exactly like this that's what it looks like and yes it smells exactly like peaches it smells so good if you ever tried the peach ulta lip oil that's what it smells like or how it used to smell like i feel like they changed the formula but that's what this smells like yeah next up i picked up another essential for me this is the essence lash princess mascara my favorite mascara it's only five dollars i'm not using months i'm using the Too Faced one which it's okay but that's what the brush looks like I'm sure you probably seen it all over TikTok too but 
yeah, it's my favorite mascara. It does the job. It stays on all day, and it's only five dollars. So. Next up, we have the NYX Liquid Slade Lipstick in the shade Alien. I used to own this, but I think they got rid of mine because it started to smell bad, but um, I picked up another one. There is a makeup look I want to do featuring a black lipstick, so that's what I got. I can swatch it for you guys. Yeah, it's just a black lipstick. Next up, we have another backup. I realized I got a lot of backup items <laughs> and things I was running out of in this haul, but this is the Maybelline Master Precise All Day Eyeliner. I have mine in the shade Black. I've tried all three. It comes in black. Um, I'm using the matte black right now and the forest brown. I use the forest brown to fill in my, my moles. Yeah, it's only $7.99 and that's what it looks like. It's a felt tip marker. I find it very easy to do, to do wing liner with it. Next up we have the e.l.f. Jelly Pop Dew Primer. I was finally able to get it. Every time I tried to get it from Ulta or Elf or Target, it was always sold out. I finally picked it up. And I used it today to prime my skin. Um, this also smells like watermelon. But I think it's a really nice primer so far. Um, it's kind of, not, it's, it's not sticky, but it's kind of thick. It leaves your face feeling tacky so your foundation can grip to it. So yeah, I really like this so far. We'll see how it goes, but got this next up we have the essence extreme lasting eye pencil in the shade black love it said they last up to 16 hours it's i swatched it already i'm swatching for you guys right now but it's very soft so i feel like it, it might smudge i don't know how it would last 16 hours but it's very soft and surprisingly i don't own a black eye pencil i used to i don't know what happened to it so please don't know. Next up, we have two concealers. The first one is another repeat item for me. This is the Elf Hydrating Camel Concealer in the shade Rich Cocoa. My favorite concealer, so I just picked up a, another one because I used to have my other one. And this one is a newer one. This is the NYX Bear With Me Concealer Serum. I got mine in the shade, I think, Deep. Nope, in the shade Rich. Yeah, they look very... Wow, on camera, they look completely different. In person, they look kind of similar this one's a little more red i think is it's, it's separated a little bit but i don't know we'll see how this one goes <laughs> last two items the first one we have is the nyx tame and frame tinted brow pomade i never used this one but i know that can tie like this so i picked this one up i have mine in the shade black it's gray in person and on camera but it's in the shade black i haven't used a brow pomade in a long time so i wanted to try some Try something else. I love my Tony Moly pencil, but I just want to try something new. And the last item we have, which I'm working open, <laughs> impatient, is the Elf Pretty Bronzer. I have mine. Wow, maybe I shouldn't have ripped open the packaging so I can tell you what shade it is. Okay, it's in the shade Beach Please. I think this is the second to darkest shade. As you can tell, it's very dark. I don't know if it's gonna bronze me or not. It might be too dark. Or my after you apply it might be way lighter, so we'll see. But it might work. So guys, that is all for the video. I hope you guys enjoy seeing what I picked up from Ulta. If you guys want to shop any of the items that I showed you guys, they will all be linked down below in the in the description box. If you want to keep up with me and Kentaya, then our link tree is in is linked in the bio, is linked in the description box. Also, you can follow us on Instagram, you can follow our business page. And yeah, bye guys.